CRISPR interference, also known as CRISPR-I, is a powerful technology within the CRISPR modulation family. CRISPR-I harnesses the precision of CRISPR to repress gene function at the transcriptional level. It's CRISPR without the cut. It's knocked down, not knock out. Let's explore more, including what Horizon has to offer for your studies. Loss of function studies are prevalent and powerful ways to interrogate genes. CRISPR knockout uses the active Cas9 nuclease to create double-stranded DNA breaks. CRISPR-I introduces a new mechanism for gene knockdown, PAM-anchored gene interference without creating double-strand breaks. CRISPR-I is well suited to study any gene and is an ideal platform for simultaneous interrogation of multiple genes. CRISPR-I based gene repression relies on deactivated Cas9 or DCAS9 associated with guide RNA. This complex targets a specific DNA sequence and binds to the DNA downstream of the gene's transcriptional start site, or TSS, blocking gene transcription. The functional result is a depletion of the target protein. Our proprietary repressor construct, covalently linked to the DCAS9 protein, further inhibits target gene expression by recruiting additional proteins involved in chromatin remodeling and gene silencing. Different studies have different experimental needs. Therefore, we are proud to be the first to offer DCAS9 mRNA for the transient delivery of the repressor and synthetic single guide RNA, in addition to more traditional vector-based solutions. By enabling gene repression at the transcriptional level, CRISPR-I provides additional flexibility for gene knockdown studies and expands the ever-growing CRISPR toolbox. Additionally, orthogonal studies using CRISPR-I in parallel with RNAi, CRISPR knockout or CRISPR activation offer a more robust approach when probing gene function. To learn how to incorporate CRISPR-I into your research, contact us today.